Ugh. Durru. <laughs> What's good? What to do, YouTube? It's your boy Dabadil. Welcome back to another video. Today we're hitting Here's the Fathom episode four. I was really excited to play this game. I'm not gonna lie. I love this series so far. I'm hoping another episode comes soon, even though I know Iron Bark like just came out. If you don't know, I stream by the way too. Uh, that's where I play most of these games online. It's twitch.tv slash Dabadil. It's gonna be the first link in the description. You can click that and catch these videos live. This is a very action packed game, which I enjoyed so much. Like I was screaming my lungs off. I'm pretty sure my neighbors heard me. But what can you do at the end of the day? I hope you enjoy the video and yeah, later. The ambience. Ooh, okay. Here's the Fathom Iron Bark Lickout. I have been so excited to play this one. Iron Bark Lickout. May 12th. Hey, I noticed you were requesting story submissions while I was watching a YouTuber play Fears of Fathom Carson House. What I'm about to recount happened when I was 24 or so at the time. It feels kind of weird telling anyone about this because of the bizarre and absurd, absurd nature of the whole thing. But I feel like doing so might help me process my memories of it. Yes, I said process and not process. I knew that sharing this story anywhere else would be a dumb idea because people would say I was lying. As I'm writing this, this was the scariest experience of my life. I'm Jack Nelson, had a small job as a park ranger in a state park. I was a fire lookout stationed in one of the largest forests in the Pacific Northwest. Miles and miles of dense forests managed to manage by forestry service. I had a salary that allowed me to make ends meet, but I couldn't afford to treat myself to restaurants, nice clothes, etc. My biggest accomplishment so far was being able to buy an RV for myself with a lot of financial help from my dad. That RV was the only sense of home I had at the time. This one time I was transferred from the one outpost to another because of some official circumstances. It was a minor inconvenience to me though, since I had lived out of my RV and liked traveling. I said a few goodbyes and I was off to the new location. It was about a two hour drive. Ooh. I'm driving. Why do they always got people texting me while I'm driving in this game? Okay. Okay, I gotta turn this off and lock in. Who's it? Oh, is this... Is this Bay? Oh, that's my ID. Let me not leak that. Oh, I'm leaked. Oh, I'm leaked. Um, how's it looking? Still on my way. Van decided to pull flat tire on me today out of all days. Isn't it late? If I don't starve to death before arriving, I'll be fine. Did you pass Roseburg yet? No, why? I don't know any of these... Oh. Can I honk? Let me honk. Oh, I can hug. Okay, why is my car moving so slow? Let's calm down. We're not about to have a repeat of the second game. Is that tree dancing? Oh, there's a whole RV. Oh, Jesus Christ. Let me not run off the road. This is a nice RV, though. I got the little, the little cutlery. I got... Let me... Okay. Let me keep my eyes on the road. Boys love the great outdoors. Hey. Just being surrounded by nature gave me happiness. I understand that. I feel like I could connect with nature in some way. I wanna talk, but I really can't fly. Okay, no, you're going off, pal. Let me pull over. Let me pull over. I said, let me pull over. I said, let me pull over. I said, let me pull over. No, I remember there's this diner while passing Roseberry. They have the best burgers in town. You have to try them out. I could really use a good meal before the staffing starts. Thanks, Kay. I saw the diner Kayla was talking about. Oh, okay, okay. Ah. Let's see if I can get some good parking. Okay, we're gonna reverse into the spot. Oh wait, that's not a spot. Hey, he grabbing! Hey, let me get some of that! Let me get some of that! Are you waving it? Oh, there's no way this dude's waving it in my face. Hold on. Oh my god, my parking is actually horrendous. Oh, I definitely just killed that guy. Ooh, wait, hold on. Oh! I can actually, like, explore in here. Hello, toilet. Maybe I can actually wash my hands this time. Oh, yeah. Oh, she's a beaut. Oh, my goodness. How's that burger? Oh, this little piece of heaven? This place is pretty much my weekend spot. You new around here? I'm just passing through. Have a safe journey. You enjoy that burger, man. Ooh, okay. I see potential. 
What is this? It's just diner. There's not even a, like a name. It's just diner. Stop. Oh, oh. Welcome to Twin River Diner. How are you doing today? Not too bad. Feel free to take any seat you'd like. I'll be right with you. All right, thank you. Oh my God, they're so nice here. Yeah, we're gonna turn that right off. I don't care. None of y'all get. I. Ooh, Uncle over here grubbing. Please leave me alone. You got it, sir. Can I interact with every single person in here? I'm gonna sit in the corner over here. No, I gotta sit right here. I'm gonna sit right here. Can I get like a menu? Oh, she's over here. Waiter! Good evening. I'm Barbara. Are you ready to order? Yes. So what can I get for you today? Ooh. Cheeseburger with fries. Grilled cheese sandwich with onion rings. Ugh. Meatball sub with chicken nuggets. Are like, wait, are the chicken nuggets like in the meatball sub? I'm gonna go with the cheeseburger just because that dude outside was absolutely munching. <laughs> Our burger is the best in the West. Would you like anything to drink? I'm gonna get a coffee. Perfect, anything else? That'll be all, thank you. Great, I'll bring the food out as soon as it's done. Just let me know if you need anything else. Well, sounds good, appreciate it. Always have this habit of peeing before eating. I mean, okay. If you insist. Oh, we're doing this again, really? Oh my god, wait, I can aim it! All right. Wait, can I actually wash my hands? Upgrades, people, upgrades. Let me go back here. Let me see what they're cooking up over here. Is Ratatouille in that man's pants? He's cooking over there. Let's see what everyone else is doing. Long day driving, huh? Where are you headed? I'm headed up north to make a delivery. What about you? Um, I'm a staffer at Ironbark State Park. So is it true? What? Whatever they say happened to those kids the other day. What happened to those kids the other day? Buddy, I don't even know what happened to those kids the other day. Possibly. I can't even imagine what the, what the parents must be going through. It's every parent's worst nightmare. I, now I'm curious. I want to know what happened. I hear something in my left ear. Barbara! My gal! I know you cooked up a fine meal for me. Ooh, okay. Where'd Barbara go? Okay. Consuming. Dang. Okay, brother. I figured it'd be a while before I had a meal like this again. Was it that good? Oh my god, he's not even eating one fry at a time. He's just grabbing a whole thing. What up, Kayla? So, Jen, I'm going? How was it? I'm here. Still eating. This is so good. Gotta be gas. I got the coffee specifically so I could stay awake. Barbara? Is that you, Barbara? Barbara? Okay. Told you. Hee <laughs> hee. This food reminds... Oh my god. Jesus. Did you enjoy the food? Yeah, it was great. Barbara, you gotta chill out. Would you like to have anything else? Or should I get the check? Check, please. Okay, I'll be right back. Dude, she just, like, jump scared me. Anywho, just send me that casserole recipe you were talking about. I might get a chance to immerse myself in the art of cuisine and the new lookout. Wow, yes, I'm on my way home. Send you in a bit? You know it. I guess that's bae. Here's the check. Your total is six six dollars and sixty cents. A 50% tip, is that crazy? I'm feeling generous. You know, I'm a real giving guy. They call me Mr. Beast. They call me Mr. Beast of the Iron Iron Bark Lookout, so I'll give him 50% tip. Thanks for the generous tip. Of course, little lady, you know how it goes up in here. All right, let's see what Mitch is... Get out the way. Let's see what Mitch is... Oh, no, no, no. I'm going to see what's going on with Bay. Let me, let me get some updates with her. This new regional manager is such a jerk. Honestly, sometimes I wish I had a job like you. Waking up with nature, away from people, and just getting paid to watch the wind go by. Wish my job was really that easy, Kay. I'm honestly done with this job. Pretty sure joining you next season. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, we're going to be working with Bay? Like I said, you're always welcome here. Let me know if you need, need, me, need me to talk to Josh. It's definitely time for a change. Speaking of change. Whoa! Wait, what is this? Ironbark Fire Department. 
This identification card. Oh, wait, so, I, oh, am I, are we working fire department? Definitely next, Ironbark next month one after Roseburg. Oh, so this is my new job. Okay, okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. What's over here? I live life on the edge. Dude, it is, I, it's not that good. Oh my God, I left the door to my RV open. Am I cooked? I'm gonna make sure nobody's in here. The bathroom door was strangely jammed. We're cooked! There's somebody in here! Buddy, it's not strangely jammed. There's somebody in here and they're waiting to kill you. Oh my god, I'm so cooked. Oh my god, it is so wraps. 8.02 p.m. Wait, no, there's definitely somebody in there because I... When I when the game first started, the bathroom door was open. I think. I'm gonna turn the radio off. I want to include the, the location of this park. But I don't want anyone seeking out the utter horrors I've seen in these woods. Am I supposed to park right here? Let me check one more time. Okay. Oh, nah. Let me get a flashlight. I don't got a flashlight. Nothing. Okay. Oh, let me close the door. See, maybe I... Maybe... Wait, did I leave the door open or did I... Did I, I swear I closed it. Ugh. Durru. <laughs> Oh my god, that actually scared me so bad that my headphones just unplugged. I don't even get scared for real, bro. Like, I'm actually on a 17, uh, 17 year streak of not getting scared, so. Holy moly, you scared me. I thought you were one of them. One of who? May Lord have mercy. Dog, you gotta calm down. Anyways, can I see your permit, please? You're Billy, right? Dot, dot, dot. I'm the new transfer fire lookout. Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? Is that correct? I don't know. We were hiring this season. Hang on. Let me check on that. Brother. Brother, there's somebody in these park. There's somebody here. <laughs> Why do you stand up like that? Okay, pal. Who are you calling, pal? You. Your R. Your R. Okay. You're going to. You're good to. What is going on? You're good to go. You're staffed at the fire tower 11. I apologize for the confusion. I was under the impression that the tower would be left unstaffed for the season. But here are your keys. Brother, I kind of don't want to walk out there. Hey. Let me open the trail gate for you. I got a, you got a flashlight or anything back here, man? That I can protect myself with? What am I talking about? Wait, I'm supposed to... Since you're arriving this late... Might also need this flashlight for the long hike to your lookout. Thank you, Billy. You be careful. Take this. Welcome to Ironbark, pal. Now, for our purposes, when you get to your tower, be sure to make your first weather report from your system, just so we know you clocked in safely. If need be, you can reach you can reach out to Tower 12 during your during your staffing. Nice enough guy. He'll be your closest contact in case of any emergency. Thank you, Billy. This is a... Yes, Billy? I thought we were done. Hey. Just a piece of advice. Don't travel any further than half a mile or so north of your tower. You got it. Bobcats and bears. Yeah, we'll go with that one. I thought he was trying to scare me, but he looked dead serious. Brother. I left my bag in the... Oh, I for Okay. Okay. Gotta go back to the RV. Why can't I just chill in this watchtower? Why do I... Why do I gotta go all the way out there? What does this say? Gold Creek Trail. 
Whoa, whoa, we got Lord alert, Lord alert. Oh wait, oh, these are the kids that that guy was. I thought this said Hugh Jackman at first. Britney Spears. Britney Spears. Please don't let her. Okay. Whatever you say. But also, there is somebody in these woods because I saw them walking past. What was that? Oh my god, I heard something to my right. That scared me. 11.32 p.m. Hey, it was a long hike and it was starting to get cold now. Tower 11 up ahead. Oh, I see it. I see it. This is nice scenery. Beautiful. Beautiful landscape, if I do say so myself. Oh my god, look how fast I can run. Lacey Trail, Tower 11. Okay, well, we're going to work, so we're going to Tower 11. Living in a fire tower is not a glamorous job. Yeah, I would imagine so. Imagine being out here alone for weeks at a time. It's not for everyone. Wait, is that what's going to happen? Am I going to be out here alone? I ascend the stairs to the top of the tower. This, look at this little rinky-dink setup. God, this is held together by a couple scraps of metal and wood. This is not secure. You're on top of the... Once you're on top of the tower, your job is to look for fires or anything out of the ordinary. What is that? Oh, okay. Hey. Cabin was filled with the aroma of woods, giving me a sense of comfort. I wouldn't feel comfortable in the woods. I was finally in my new home for the next few months. Is there a light switch in here? Forgot to turn the generator on. What generator? What generator? Oh, wait, was it? Was it? I think it was down, down there, huh? I'm going to keep this open. Yep, there's a generator. Oh my god, that scared me. I thought I saw someone right there. This is really scary, I won't lie. The woods, the woods in general, like, freak me out. But I feel like being put in a situation like this, I would be so scared. Turn the lights on. Hey, we're living good up in here. You know it, man. All right, let me put my bag on my bed. Okay, no, this is definitely a bad idea having these open, right? Tower 11, Tower 12. This is Tower, this is tower 11. You copy. Over. Tower 11 and Tower 12. This is Tower 11. Do you copy? Over. All right. I had to report for tonight. How do I do that? Oh, okay. Now it wants to work. Okay. Hey, what's the password? Password is... Password. No. Tower 11. No. Okay. Oh, right in front of my face. Okay. All lookouts must follow these rules while occupying this tower. Lights out after 12 p.m. Supply drops are handed out every Sunday. Absolutely no guests in the lookout. System password is Ironbark Tower Number. I was close. I said Tower 11. Refuel the generator routinely. Update the reporting software routinely. No video games in the system. Remember to call your sister station before you sleep. Okay. Iron Bark 11. Yeah. Dang, it's like they got a whole computer system in this. Hey. Ooh. Hello there. It's Smiley, your trusty virtual assistant. Here to help you make the most of your computer today. Nice to meet you, Smiley. Welcome to the state-of-the-art service reporting software. <laughs> tower 11 over Tower 12. This is Tower 2 11. Do you copy? New guy. I haven't gotten your oh. name yet. What is it again? They got voice acting. Oh my god, wait, we're making upgrades. I'm Jack. I saw your light turn on. I gotta say, it's refreshing to see Tower 11 alive again. Hey, buddy. I'm here for a long time. We're going to be best buds. You were watching? Isn't that the job? I've had to Isn't cover your area until Why you arrive. I... I'm Connor. Fire Tower 12. Connor, Fire Tower 12. Nice to meet you. This is Jack. Over. Anyways, what brings you to this towering paradise of ours? 
Um, I'm just looking for change, honestly, man. What's with the what's with the blank noise, pal? <clears throat> I'm a transfer from Iron Horse. Experienced comrade. Yeah. I'm really tired. You got a fire going? Get no. Away. The temperature is about to plummet. You don't want to sit through the storm shivering. Got it. Thanks. What a good guy. Oh. I don't see the smoke. Did you light it up yet? Oh, there was no the firewood. Should be around the entrance. Get her lit. I need firewood. What does that sound? What's that sound? Are they doing an airstrike on me? Whoa! No! No! Oh no! No! Place on fire! Whoa! 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 There's no firewood. There must be plenty in the shack. That's all Marley did. Okay, I need to bring a weapon with me. What is this? Bear spray. Oh yeah, we're taking this with us. Is that where the wood is? Okay. Let me get some wood. Hold on. Playing Minecraft right now. Oh wait, there's more gasoline and stuff down here. <gasps> oh wait, there's a bunch of stuff down here. Okay. We're locked in, we're locked in, we're locked in. Hold on. Yeah, okay, wait. Hold on, do I have more of that bear spray? Oh, whoa, 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 I did not mean to do that. Needed gasoline. Buddy, I put gasoline in there. Ooh, put all that in there. Yeah. Oh my god, it's leaking on the floor. We're, I'm, I'm actually about to blow this whole place up. I'm not going to lie. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ah, I see it. Oh, jeez. I see the smoke. Okay, Connor. The sea tower living alive again. Hey, man. I'm going to be here for a while. Did you report for the night yet? I did not. Hold on. Let me report for the night. Let me get my bear. I, I'm keeping my bear spray in hand, low key. No, let me get to it. Here at Iron Bark, you are required to report every night before signing off. I I understand you don't that. Don't want to disappoint Mitch on your first night. Me and Mitch were like this, buddy. Me and Mitch, we go way back. Okay, how do I report? Temperature. How do I? Oh, this is 2002. I gotta measure. I gotta measure the the wind and stuff. This. What's the wind looking like? 18 knots, 18 knots. I'm gonna do 18. Now, do we got, what do we got? What do we got here? What do we got here? What is this? Okay, this is a compass. I need, I need to check the, the temperature. How do I, how do I check the temperature? Am I just supposed to guess? Oh yeah. It's a cool 42 degrees out here. Should I, should I take a guess? I mean... 42, I don't know. Zero hikers assisted. It's cloudy. Reported by... Dabba Dill. You know it, man. Something didn't look right. Let's see, let's see. Oh, right here. Oh, wait, don't tell me I was... Oh my god, wait. Hold on, I might have been actually right. Temperature was 45. Oh, I said 40. I said 42. I said 42. I'm taking that as a dub in my book. Hold on. It was clear. There we go. James Gorsio. Copy, new guy. That's Tower 11. I copy. Do you copy? Over. I think I'm going to sign off for the day. Okay. Tower 12. Signing off. You have a good night. Don't let the bed bugs bite. That wasn't funny. Good night, Connor. Talk to you tomorrow. Over. Where's his tower? Oh, over there. Okay, he just turned his light off. Oh, we're chilling. Oh, we are chilling. Okay. Hey, wait, wait. I see this up top. Employee Welcome training. to Iron Bark State Park. Is that Jack Septic? Watching this video, then let me be the first to say congratulations. Yeah.
You have been commissioned by the Iron Bark Fire Department to protect one of the most prestigious parks in the state of Washington. No, oh, based in Washington, okay. Established in 1897, we have been known as one of the safest parks in America. Okay. We hope you can keep it that way for many years to come. I'm the world's greatest uh, state This park training Superman. video will ensure that you work to the best of your abilities. Okay. You have been selected as one of our fire lookout observers. You know This it, is a truly rewarding job which requires many hours of hard work. You will be working in our state-of-the-art lookout towers. I don't and know about state-of-the-art. The responsibilities you will have. Keep watch for fire. I can do that. Fire isn't going to be noticeable all of the time. So also keep watch for smoke. Make okay. sure to know what color the smoke is. It may be crucial information. Okay. Fires are best stopped before they spread out I'm of hand. Drink and drive. Keep records of daily temperature. In GTA. When the temperature rises, it is best that we have those recorded. Okay. The science nerds at the Panoramic Preservation Society. This is not a scientist. All changes in temperature. Okay. We think it's best not we to hate get lawsuits. into a lawsuit. Yep. Keep campers out of unregistered campgrounds. The okay. campers might start a campfire, which could lead to a wildfire. They will yeah, not we don't always want that. listen to authority, so take precaution when escorting them. Okay. Make sure to know whether the person is a threat. If you're worried about your safety, do not hesitate to dial 911. I thought I was 911. Bedtime. 3.26 a.m. Oh. Oh. Unintel uh, unintelligible. Unintelligible. What is that? Oh, nah. I had to pee. No, brother. There's something going on. Connor? Oh, nah. Oh, nah. Oh, nah. Where's my flashlight? What's that sound? Oh, I'm cooked. What is this? Hey! Looks like you're ready to take on some zombies and have a blast. Good luck. Aim for the head. Oh! Oh, this is wrong! Let me, let me lock in. Let me lock in. Let me lock in. Whoa. Why do I feel like everything just got really zoomed in? Okay. On my first night being out in the cabin, it gave me a strange feeling. Yeah. It doesn't help the fact that, oh, being left alone here was some somewhat unsettling. It also doesn't help that the porta potty is at the very, like, most inconvenient. I'm stuck. Space to. Oh! Am I just. Oh, okay. I literally can aim too. I hope I'm not hitting anybody down below. This dude needs to drink some water. That's all. Hawaiian punch right there. Close that right back up. We're going right back to bed. Night two. Oh, is this going to be like some Five Nights at Fred? Oh. Just you and the wind. Time just melts away. It is beautiful. Take photo. Oh my God. Yeah, it's beautiful. Oh my god, look at that. Look at that sunset. Oh my goodness. Beautiful. Man, what a beautiful day. New guy, do you copy? I do copy. Connor from Tower 12. What do up, Connor? Copy? I do. Let me put this in the dishes real quick. Hold on. Oh, let me not break it. Oh. Tower 11, do you copy? Copy that. Connor, what's up? Son of a bitch. What? What, over? Nobody bothers to get a camping permit these days. Why do you say you that? Have eyes on the smoke north of your position. Let me have a look. Got my compass. My hands were full. Oh, yup. Smoke was white. I need you to confirm. You spot that white smoke up north? <laughs> yeah, I see it. Over. <laughs> it appears to be in the lazy trail sector, which is not a registered campsite. Ooh, they're doing illegal camping. Like that, don't Okay. Am I checking it out? You want me to go over there? Is Healer, it safe? Carry your bear spray, and you should be fine. 
Do you have any other details? Okay. Follow Lazy Trail. Keep an eye out for any signs of a campfire or any potential hazards along the way. Okay, headed north. I'll report back on it. Don't forget to carry your bear spray in these woods, new guy. Over I won't. But he, uh, I was on you about that bear. I was on that bear spray before you were. We got my bear spray. Do I need my flashlight? Do I carry my flashlight or... I'm gonna I'm I'm carry the flashlight just in case. You never know. Oh, we're definitely about to encounter a bear for sure. Look at that. Caution area. 837. Dang! How slow do you walk? Okay, it was a good thing I brought my flashlight. I followed the trail that led me to the smoke. Oh, I'm absolute. Sir! Sir! Where are you? I can help you! Sir! Oh, it's just an empty campsite. What's that? Get in the tent! Who's whistling? Oh, everything's okay. Sorry, okay. Oh my god, Jesus Louise. What's going on? Brother! Do I gotta go over here? Whoa! There was somebody moving right there. Oh, nah. See. Oh, no. I got a machete. I'm chilling. Sir! Who's there? Show yourself! You're about three seconds before I lay it down right now. You are not safe. I have a blick on my side. No? Okay. Yep. We're running the other way. The area beyond that site was closed. Yep. And he can stay over there then. I'll take my happy self right back in the way home. <laughs> Nobody wants to do anything. I'm taking myself home. I knew we need to put our campfire. Bro, come on. That dude that was back there can handle it. Why do I got to? I had to put it on. Oh, okay. How do I put it out? Oh, let me let me use some IQ points. Hold on. Yeah, okay. Now we grab our bear spray. And we get out of here. I hear something. I hear something to my right. Oh my god, I just went. 907. As I hiked back to my tower to the dark, I couldn't shake the sense that something was terribly wrong. My mind couldn't help but think what might have happened. Buddy. I'm gonna keep it a buck. You just keep yourself. You keep it. You keep it to yourself. Keep it pushing. Keep it pushing. You keep it pushing. You know... Keep your head down. You stay nonchalant. You stay mysterious. Don't worry about anybody but yourself out here, man. I had to report to Connor about the vacant campsite. Connor, do you copy? Over. Hey, Connor, do you copy? Loud and clear, new guy. I was just cooking ah. myself some hot. Well, first, what's your status? Are you kidding me? I know, I'm not kidding you. Son of a bitch. They never learn, do they? They don't learn, unfortunately. What do you mean? I'm sick of these bastards. It's oh. Unbelievable. Okay, sir. Has this been happening a lot? This is the third time this month alone. Dang, you all need to do something about it. Get some some security. Hire the bears at this point. Anything else you notice in those woods? Mention the scream. A scream. Must have been one of those red foxes. They sound pretty much like a screaming lady at night. I don't think it was a fox. I'm pretty sure I saw a person. It was a manly scream. Yeah, it was like my scream when I got jump scared at the beginning. I don't know what you're talking about, new guy. But I heard from the rangers that a lot of campers have been flocking to that area lately because of the disappearance of those three kids. Are... I'm sorry, do we have the Ghostbusters in these woods? I mean, are they trying to find something? About a month ago, they were hiking with their families. They went off the trail and just vanished. Oh, nah. No trace of them since. They got taken into the upside down. What happened to those kids? I don't know. Their parents said some whistle led them off the trail. It's unbelievable. People have started spreading rumors that the area might be haunted by some entities. Okay, maybe we do need the Ghostbusters out here. It's crazy, I know. You would think these rumors would scare people off, but apparently it's been the opposite. 
I mean, I feel like the thrill, the thrill of the adventure would kind of drag people in. I don't blame them. I only wish they were true. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean you wish that was true? Well, at least now you know why Mitch had to staff Tower 11 urgently. Mm -hmm. Um, glad right. to be of service. Anyways, thanks for staying vigilant. Always. contact the authorities so they can take care of this commotion first thing in the morning. We can't tolerate these goons anymore. <laughs> Are they goons? What? Come That's on. crazy! I'll personally make sure they never set foot in this forest again. Alright, agreed. Keep safe, me updated. Guys. Over and out. You too, over and out. Over. They should make it to where you can open those. Kayla, my girl, my bad, my bad, babe. Let me, let, let me give Bay some attention. Hold on. Woo! By the way, look what I got home too. Hey, she got two beers. She got three beers on a lasagna. It's like Garfield's dinner. Okay, she gave me the recipe for that pizza uh, casserole. Mom made the same casserole recipe today. Nom nom hee hee. Look at that photo makes my stomach growl. As a matter of fact, let me try that recipe now. All right. Oh, I'm about to I'm about to be cooking it up in here. Hold on. Okay, we got uncooked pasta, marinara sauce. Let me get let me get all the ingredients. All right, we're just leaving all that out of there. Hey, we're cooking, we're cooking. Hey, guy. Oh. There. Connor, I thought you were going to bed, pal. Hey, guy. You got me. What is it? Over. Uh, just reported their ass to the authorities. Hey, lock in. Good job, good job. I hope so too, man. We'll keep an eye on things from here. You stay vigilant for such smoke moving forward. That's the duty I chose. I don't see your name here. Did you report for the night yet? Oh, I'll just get into it. You got it. I think I'm gonna hit the sack now. I know it's been Have a good night's sleep, man. You're doing an excellent job up there. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Uh, thank you, Connor. Over twelve. Signing off. Over and out. Good night, Connor. Over and out. All right. Let me let me lock in for the night. Hold on. What are these winds looking like? 18 knot winds. Boom. Then we got 47.6. Buddy. Okay, we'll put cloud. Hold on, while, I, while that's cooking. While that's cooking, let me, uh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey. hey. Perfect timing. I just remember the smell of fresh sizzling cheese. Oh boy. I'm excited. I like eating in bed. There's no way you're about to bring this entire tray into bed. That, that's actually big back activities. I won't lie and I fully support it. I thought I just heard something. I was already full. All right. But he just brought the whole thing in his bed for no reason. Can I put it in the fridge? Ah, okay. Is it bedtime now? Please tell me it's bedtime. Getting cold. Thought I would stove lit. Oh, I got to get more firewood, huh? Oh my gosh. Dude, these woods are like terrifying for no reason. I'm grabbing it and sprinting back. I don't care. I don't care. Alrighty. Let's get this fire started. Okay. Bedtime. Let's go, man. Wait, and I'm supposed to I'm supposed to stay up here for months? 227 AM. This guy has a problem with waking up. I was woken up by some feel I was woken by some feeling that caused my eyes to drift open. The whistle. The whistle. The whistle. I'm not gonna get up. Why would I get up? He's at the window. Oh, nah. Oh, nah. There's...
I felt a presence outside, and what do you want me to do about it? I'm not going out there. Actually, matter of fact, I am going out there. Where my bear spray? Where my bear spray? Stuck a Yugo regret coming to this place. Ah! Taking myself right back to bed. Buddy, you. There is a spiritual, there's a spiritual real, ritualistic item outside your door right now, and you're worried about talking to Connor. Buddy, you are so cooked. Just, Connor. Connor, do you copy? Do you copy? I need to talk to you. It's urgent. Hello? Do you have any idea what time it is? There's something outside my door. Just couldn't wait until morning. There's a skull yeah, in my... It's probably best to ignore these kids messing around. I suspect that's what Marley got tired of. What if this is not a prank? Kids can be pretty creative with these pranks. Oh my Why god. Connor, this is why you're gonna die and I'm not. This is serious, you don't understand, do you? Away, guy. We're in the middle of nowhere. Alright, here's what we'll do. I'll send someone to check in on you tomorrow. No, send someone to check on me right now. For now, just lock your door. It'll be morning before you know it. Connor, I feel like you're stressing me more out than these dudes. Good night, Connor. Connor didn't make any sense. On goodness. There's nothing much else I could have done in the dark. Um, stay awake? I'm gonna go back to bed. Jeez, man. Okay, but now we know that we can hide under that bed. That means we're definitely gonna have to. Night three. Next day I woke up not being so sure if last night was real or just a dream. Connor tried to reason, reason it as a harmless prank by some kids. But there's something about that night that just felt darker. There's something strange happening in those woods. I occupied most of my days either with a simple maintenance in and around the tower. Or by scanning the densities of the trees all around me. Oh, let me clean that up. My paranoia for the woods only grew after last night, which led me to be extra vigilant moving forward. Oh. Oh, that's crazy. The immersion in this game is actually insane. What was that? Oh. Somebody just let off a flare. Hello? Is anyone there? That doesn't sound like Connor. I, I need help. Please. You need help, sir. Someone answer. I got you. I got you. I can Hello? save you. Can anyone hear me? This is Jack Town oh. 11. Thank goodness. I I'm lost. And I'm, I'm really My starting God. to freak it's it's like really loud what's going on take a deep okay, breath take a okay. deep breath okay calm down sir calm down what's going on tell me that whoa what, what's the I, situation i don't even know where to start i, I went out to explore the area and okay. lost track of time and, and now it's dark and i can't remember the trail back to my truck okay okay that's fine think, that's okay i think i'm lost um this would be a stupid question what equipment do you have with you what? What equipment do you yeah, have with you? I have a you? flashlight, a compass, a fully charged two-way radio, a flare gun, and, and some of my camping equipment. Can you describe your... your red your... jacket, camo pants, and a green backpack. Okay. What's uh, your current location? I'm in the middle of the woods, on this trail surrounded by trees. Everything looks different at night. I thought okay. shooting That's a fine. few flare gun shots might get someone's attention, but no one's come yet. All it did was light up the trees and make everything look even scarier. I just want to find a way out of here. Um, what direction are you facing right now? Right now, because I remember walking east when I came here. Okay. Remember any landmarks? I, I remember passing a small stream earlier. Okay. Oh, thank goodness, I see it. I'm see at what? a trail intersection now, but I can't remember if I should take the right trail or the left to get back to the trailhead. Can you help me? Let me scan the map and get back to you. He said he's at an intersection. Uh, hello? Hold on, man. Uh, are, are you still there? Both of these trails seem pretty similar. Uh, I'm just so anxious about making a mistake and going further away from the road. Let me help you, brother. 
Jeez. Okay, he said he's at an intersection. I'm not gonna lie, brother. I don't know how to help. I think he's right here. So we want him to go left. We want him to go left. Sir. I'm at a trail intersection. Take the left trail. I knew it. I thought it looked familiar. Yep, yep, yep. I couldn't have trusted myself with this decision. <laughs> Thanks for helping me through this. Um, you're welcome. I'm right here. What do you mean? I hear you. What? What do you mean you hear me? I hear your whistles. I'm in my tower what? right now. I see you behind the trees to my right. That's not me. You're freaking me out. What? what? Get up. Want me to go out there? Oh, oh my god. Holy moly, what took you so long in there? Been knocking for hours. I was asked to check in on you. What are you up to, pal? Or just assisting a lost hiker. This hour, may the Lord be merciful. This guy knows something that nobody else knows, apparently, because... Anyways, got your tower supplies here. Just the usual essentials. Here you go. I feel like I'm going to pass out if I keep holding this for one more second. Take, I'm okay. Let me take these supplies from you, pal. What were you doing in there last night? What do you mean? Up north. Why were you there? I wouldn't screw around there, pal. I was required to investigate on a campfire smoke. Oh, Lord have mercy. Nasty business up there, pal. Bobcats and bears. Buddy, I think you're a little more afraid than bobcats and bears. Be careful out there, pal. These woods aren't normal. There's stuff out there that you would love to get a piece of you. What do you mean by that? Not to mention, you'd be quite a distance from help if anything happened. I think this guy's the real murderer here. I've been hearing, I've been hearing you been a bit on the edge. Everything all right? Mention the skull. Oh, Lord have mercy. This dude keeps saying, Lord have mercy. Did you take a photo of it before cleaning it up? No. You know, it's best we don't dwell on these things. Besides, we can't do anything without the evidence. Anyways, it's getting late. I better get going now. Just keep a watch. Thanks for the supplies. I'm gonna follow this guy. I'm gonna follow you, pal. I was too hungry. Of course you were, bud. Uh, oh, I didn't ever text Bay that the lasagna was good. Let me heat it up. Hey, it's 420. 420, you know what that means. All right, well, that's heating up. How are none of these hitting? All righty. Okay. We're having a chill night, you know. Tonight will be fine. Tonight will be fine. I'm feeling good vibes tonight, you know. Just chilling, eating my lasagna. Nice little crib I got, though. I won't lie. Okay. That in the dishes. I think we're chilling. Oh, I saw the report for the night. Grab this. Twenty six. Ooh. Twenty six and fifty seven point two. Okay. Fifty seven point two. Oops. And twenty six. Let's check those cloud conditions. Hold on. Looking cloudy. It's looking cloudy. Now it is time to hit the hay. And I swear if I wake up in the middle of the night. Thought I was getting cold. Thought I'd. Uh oh. Oh no, bro. I'm gonna have to get the wood again. They wouldn't be stupid enough to come down in these parts. They'll catch a, a little piece of thing one and thing two. <laughs> oh my god. Hold your horses. you know who you're messing with you almost just caught a mean piece of of thing one and not only that thing one is gloved up 
Thing two would have been raw power. Let's put a pause on that. We're gonna get back to game. You just gave me a heart attack. I understand loneliness can make mind play tricks on you. What's your name? Names can be deceiving. Call me Silius. Who are you? No need to be alarmed. I'm a worker. I was just doing usual maintenance on the radio tower over there. All right, Silius. Silius, whatever. Thought I'd say hi, the new guy everyone's been talking about. You usually work this late? Every Sunday. Just trying to keep the communication lines open. Oh, what a good guy. He's actually a really cool guy. You must ensure that the right message reached the right places. Wouldn't you agree? Right. We rely on information about fire sightings. Absolutely. But some fires are meant to burn. No amount of prevention can stop them. What do you mean? Nature has its own plans. Some things can't be controlled no matter how hard we try. Okay. Sometimes disasters are just another form of cleansing. A way for the land to purify itself. So you're on, Silas? Have a good night, Jack. Hope you sleep well, but remember. Curiosity can lead to places you'd rather not go. Farewell, Jack. God. Oh my goodness, he's caked up. No, it's leaking. I see the smoke coming out of your tower. No, don't tell me you're not in there. I am in there. New guy, you there? Hold on. There we go. Oh my god, there's gasoline everywhere. Oh my goodness. Why would that be a problem if I was in here? Now. Right here. Bottom clear. Went down to get firewood. Ran into Silius downstairs. The guy maintaining that nearby radio tower? What is this guy, is this guy Connor think he is? It's just about yesterday. What do you mean? You to yank my chain now? What do you mean, brother? And who did I just talk to? If what you're saying is true, it could be another one of those goons playing pranks on you. He knew my name. Knew your name. You think he's been listening? I'm not sure. Disguising as a staff member is strictly forbidden according to park guidelines. I would hope so. I mean, next time you see him, get his information or take a photo. We need to figure this out. Sure. Anyways, I'm seeing that you've already reported. Yeah, me too. Signing off. Over. Over and out. Over and out, man. I need to go to bed. I'm tweaking out right now. Silius is a freak. That probably means his real name isn't even Silius. Or is it Silius? I don't know at this point. My unease is starting to grow with each passing day. So when I signed off that night, I told myself that it was just a change of environment that I needed to get it used to. The strangeness I'd seen so far in those woods was not enough to cause an alarm yet. However, that would soon change. Two nights later. Hey, that means we're chill for another two nights. 9 18 p.m. Oh, it's raining. You, guy. you got a minute? I'm oh, listening. Good news. Just heard from the HQ. They say we've got a new system update on the computer. Hey, you want to let you know. They say it's an important security update. No you got it. Snoopers, I guess. Uh, thanks for letting me know. All right, let's get a little, let's run a little update. Um. Help. Oh, wait, wait. Okay, hold on. I got to check for an available update. Okay. Oh, I'm stupid. There we go. Yeah, look at that. No. What was that? Why'd the light turn off? Power was out. Oh my god. 
I actually cannot see a thing. Jeez, man. It is pouring. Generator ran out of gas. Okay, let me get the gas. Let me get the gas. Let me fill you up, brother. Yeah. I really had to pee. Oh my god. 2.34 a.m. We got another one. Brother, I'm mid-sleep right now. What do you mean we got another one? I know it's late, but you're going to want to see this one, Jack. Okay. Jack, I'm getting... I'm getting... Wake up. You copy? I'm getting up, brother. Hold on. Jack, you copy? Why are you okay, still out? Anyone. Why is it always got to fall on me? I mean, what happened? My ass, on I've been busting me. Let me have a look. You know what? What? Bro, come on, don't sell on me like this. Hey, don't run away this time. Take your photos and IDs. And if things get worse, don't hesitate to call HQ for help. Update me tomorrow morning. I'm gonna get some rest. Okay. Um Oh yeah, they're down there. Bro, come on, man. Hold on, let me get my binoculars. Let me see. Wait, can I take a picture from here? What's going on? Is that... I think that's a certain, um... Group of people that I cannot- Are they like burning someone alive? Had to make a run. Go. Huh? <laughs> Go! To the poor body! 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 Run, run, I'm just sprinting. I'm just sprinting. I'm just sprinting. I'm just sprinting. I'm just sprinting.
Go. Run. Run. Run forever. Run forever. Run forever. Don't stop running. Run like your legs are about to fall off. You are going to die if you stop running. Go. 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 To the van. 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 As the general kicked in and hit the gas and drove to the nearest ranger, IQ out of breath, I radio to the radio. <laughs> Next morning, authorities allegedly ran a small investigation in the area, but of course, they met with no signs of misconduct. No one ever believed my story, dismissing it as a part of product of isolation. Just stick to looking in for fryers, Mitch offered. However, that was the last time I ever set foot in those woods. The unease still hits heavy in my stomach. Even though many years have passed, the experience still feels vivid in my memory. My family thought I was making this whole thing up, which is really out of my character. But I know what I saw. Real or not, after dark, these woods can become a, ha a haven for illegal activities. So if any of you plan on going camping soon, please be safe. Let's go, man. Let's go.